Today we are going to be looking at how to make this lovely subscribe button for YouTube. You can implement this wherever you want, on your channel, on your website, or wherever you so wish. So let's get started. So welcome to Z Tutorials. As you saw from the intro we are going to be making that subscribe button that you just looked at. And first off what we want to do is just grab our shape tool. Now all these gradients I have here, I have on my left the gradient with the two colors I'm using and I have the text color and the stroke color just so you guys know what I'm working with here. So select your rectangle tool, now if you don't want to select it this way you can always just set the width and the height to whatever pixels you want. Maybe 200 pixels by 50 pixels will do nice. You can judge that yourselves anyway. Now it's going to set to a default foreground color. Just go to your shape tool down here on your layers panel right click and go to blending options it'll bring up this dialog box and you just want to go to gradient overlay when you've that selected it's going to set to defaults which is black to white click on that gradient color and you want to go to the black here double click on that little arrow we want to use our eyedropper tool to grab this color here if you don't know the color it is FED81C you can input that down in the bottom there where it says the hash sign click OK when you're happy with that move on to the white and you want to select this lighter yellow color this is an triple F 9C1 click OK when you're happy with that and OK again next up is our stroke so go down here and click on stroke black will be the default click on the color there using my eyedropper tool I'm going to select this color it's EC101 ECC101 that should be I think on the position here you want to change that to inside so it's not on the outside and you can select your pixel size I'm going to leave mine at 2 pixels when you're happy with that just click OK and that is our shape done that's all it was it's very very easy now we want to move on to our text so select the T tool meaning text you want to select a new layer by going down here to the right corner and selecting layer on that layer just click anywhere on the page now you want to select your attributes. On the color here, our foreground color, we are going to select this dark brown, which is a 994800. Click OK when you're happy with that. Select your text font size and your font type. My font type is going to be Arial. And I am leaving it at regular, no bold or italic. And of course, my size is around 50 point. Type in your subscribe there. And when you're happy with all your settings, check the button on the top right corner. Now you want to align this to the center. Select your move tool and you can move it around whatever way you please but a really easy way to do it and especially for you guys who just selected the height and width to begin with and you didn't worry about drawing out your rectangle you just did your gradient straight away. You just want to go select all on the subscribe layer. So select in your layers panel that text that you just did. It should say subscribe on it. Then you want to press control A or select all then you want to select your move tool and right up here on the properties you just want to select align it to the middle of the top horizontally and vertically and it will align it perfectly for you now obviously it's not working for me properly because I have a bigger I'm drawing it on another layer anyway so I can just move that around myself use your arrow keys to align it perfectly and when you're happy that's all you have to do so now we're done, that is our subscribe button complete, it wasn't very hard, it was very easy actually. I hope you guys liked it, make sure you hit that like button if you do. If you're having some trouble make sure to leave me a comment because I do get back to all the people who leave a comment. If you like these tutorials, go ahead and subscribe because I am releasing videos three times a week and I hope you guys like them. So that's all for today, thank you guys for watching, this is Z Tutorials, signing out.